Hey guys, this is Tony with Echo Network, and in this video, I'll show you how to add your custom domain uh, to your store domains so that your affiliates can use your custom domain when they sign up through your site. So in this video, we're going to assume that you already have your custom domain uh, added into Deco Network. Uh, if you haven't done that yet, uh, you'll want to search our YouTube videos on uh, how to add your custom domain. Uh, and when you do, come on back and uh, we'll continue. Uh, but we'll proceed here. So what we'll do is, uh, before we get started, we're going to jump into our DNS settings. Uh, whoever that might be, I have GoDaddy, so you're going to see a GoDaddy screen here. And we want to change our CNAME record here. So let me go over here to uh, my GoDaddy site here. So you've already created your custom domain before uh, and you added it to your website. We're just going to make a small change here. And what we're going to do is we're going to change um, the CNAME record from www and we're going to change it to an asterisk. Now this is, this is a wild card that's going to allow uh, us to use uh, multiple uh, domains on here or subdomains on here. Okay, so once you've done that, we're all set. So let's go back here. And I'm going to add my custom domain in here. And we're going to verify it. Sorry, we need to save it first and then we'll verify. So I will save it. Okay, so it's already verified here. Uh, depending on your uh, host provider, uh, who's ever hosting your uh, domain, uh, could take longer uh, depending. So um, uh, I, I would give it a few hours. Sometimes it might even take uh, up to 48 hours depending on the host provider. Um, so if, if it doesn't work immediately, uh, just make sure that uh, you give it enough time uh, to kick in. Okay, so uh, I've now verified it here. So now I can use uh, my domain uh, for my affiliate. So let's see what that looks like. We'll go to websites and I'm going to add a store. And we're going to say it belongs to me. Okay. And now you'll see I have a, my custom domain as an option uh, in addition to um, these Deco Network ones. So when the affiliate signs up, they can just use that. So uh, we'll just do um, a quick sign up here because we also want to see uh, how to... Um, how to apply the SSL to affiliate stores once we've done this here. Okay, so we'll go ahead and save it and it's going to create my store for me. Okay, so the store is created and now I can go into my domain settings. We're gonna to go to edit and what I'll do is change this to this uh, uh, Deco Apparel site. And this will be our system um, URL. Now, the reason I'm doing this is because we can't add the custom SSL um, or we can't add the SSL to uh, our system domains, but we can add them to uh, custom domains. So what I'll do is I'll do, um, I'll add that one that we just added there. So now it's going to be a custom domain. And once we add it on here, see it's now custom. So I can make it my primary domain and then I can apply the SSL to it. So I'll just go in there, click Save. Okay, and then uh, it usually takes somewhere between five and 10 minutes to kick in, uh, but once you've done that, you have successfully applied the SSL certificate uh, to your affiliate store. Uh, now I will tell you that the uh, Let's Encrypt only allows uh, uh, 50, uh, websites to work on the on the SSL, so you can only do this for 49 affiliates, up to 49 affiliates. So if you have more than that, uh, you'll need a different domain uh, to achieve this. So thanks for watching. Hope this helps. Take care.